So it's really been a long time since I just sat back and made a webcam video of a review. And today I'm going to review Coldplay's new CD, Milo Xyloto. I think that it's mainly a good album. It's not Coldplay's best work. Like, Viva La Vida was a masterpiece, and so was A Rush of Blood to the Head. Just about everybody, every Coldplay fan owns that album by now. So, I think it's good, but it's not their best. Overall, I'm not really sure what I'd give it. I'd probably give it three and a half or four stars. You see, I've always really found Coldplay interesting because every one of their albums is sort of like a new, like, sort of genre. They really went, like, they were really just alternative with Rush of Blood. Um, they went very electronic in X and Y. And Viva La Vida was, they had more of that rock sound, the guitars came in. And this album is really sort of poppy. You see, I think what they're trying to do is they're trying to fit into the crowd a little bit, which I don't really like, but I think that it's a good album because there's actually some good production on some of the songs. Even though the CD is a concept album, it's really like each of the different, each of the different songs, they really have sort of a different sound to them. But in some cases, the production actually enhances the real songs. Like, for example, a good highlight of the album would be the song Major Minus, which is which has a really good guitar riff. It's awesome. And it has some very good production that actually enhances the song. The tracks I would recommend are probably Hurts Like Heaven, which is the opener, the album opener, track two after the short introduction. Because I feel like that one really sort of gets you going. It's an upbeat song, and it's really just... It's very entertaining to listen to. Highlights are really sort of mixed up. There's Song 4, which is Charlie Brown. There's, um, I'm just looking at the album, the back album cover. I think Princess of China is a good one with Rihanna, but I wouldn't consider it a highlight because it, it is very poppy. It is a little bit more generic than the rest of them on the album. It's a little less original, I guess. UFO is really a nice one. Point blank, I think I would praise this album for its production. I think the songwriting could be better for Coldplay, but I think the production is good. Overall, most of the songs are pretty solid. I think I'd give it 7.5 out of 10. I don't know. It's a, it's a good album. It's not their best, but it's good. And I'm just a PS. I think a few songs on the album sound a little bit... I don't mean like copying, but I think I can tell that this album probably influenced by the band Phoenix. So if you like that French band or the band that put out 1901, Listomania, if you like Phoenix by any chance, I think you'd like this album probably.